Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. That's gonna be doing my hair and da 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 da. Where are you? Boom! Did I scare you? Yeah. The tables have turned. Hi guys, welcome back. As you can tell from today's video title, I am going to be trying different hairstyles on Sienna. We've been through a lot in the last couple of years. You know, some big moments. The Ellen Show. We've been to Flight House, we've been to the Hype House. We've done a lot of stuff, and Sienna's hair is always looking so good. What some of you guys may not know, I don't always do Sienna's hair. I'm really good at the basics. I can throw a ponytail up, some good brushing. Little pigtails? Yeah, little pigtails. I've had so much help from my mom, from my sisters, from Zara, from Sienna's mom, Victoria, all, all over to help us get her hair looking good. So, it is my goal this year to become a master French braider. So today we are going to be doing some different hairstyles. We've narrowed it down to five hairstyles ranging from very, very easy to pretty difficult, okay? First off, we're gonna start with the ponytail. Then we're gonna do some pigtails. After that, I thought it'd be an easy transition into space buns. Then we're gonna learn how to braid. And I say learn because I don't know how to braid. So we have an expert hairstylist here with us for this collaboration today. Ladies and gentlemen, Zara Angelica. <laughs> so. Thank you for joining us. This is what we like to call in the business a French braid. And that's actually what we're gonna be finishing off with is a French braid. We also have a pretty little bowl with some questions in it from our Instagram followers. So we'll be answering some of those questions. Excuse me. Yes. When I first saw that come in, it looked like there was water in it. It looked like there was water in it? Well, there's not. Would you like to pick the first question? Well, this one is from one of your awesome friends on Roblox, Nicole3949, also known as Jojo Siwa fan. She wants to know what our favorite collaboration is. Obviously, we make videos with Jonathan and Michael a lot, right? Charlie, D'Amelio, Dixie, Alex, Thomas, Cover. We've also made videos with Jojo Siwa. That's just some of them. So out of all of those ones, who is your favorite one that we've made videos with? Jojo, because like we made like a YouTube video and like a TikTok, like both. And because she's pretty awesome, isn't she? My favorite collaboration, Sienna? Yeah. Someone that I forgot to say earlier to you. Demi Lovato. Can we, can we? <laughs> I mean, we didn't like meet up to make content. Ellen surprised us. We were singing a song, remember? And she came in the dressing room. Mm -hmm. And at first you didn't even recognize that it was her, huh? Cause she looked a little bit different than what you were used to seeing her. I think my soul left my body when um, she walked in the room. Oh my God. Are you serious? <laughs> Hi, cutie. <laughs> How are you? Oh, you're so beautiful. Can I have a hug? Oh, thank you so much. Go on and try to tear me down. I will be rising from the ground like a skyscraper. I am getting close. <gasps> Oh my gosh, you scared me! Yikes! We have finished the first hairstyle. Oh, beautiful! You did the best job on You think, that one. can I see? Let me see. Wow, so beautiful. I love it. I think that's a great ponytail. I mean, you can't get a ponytail greater than that. Pigtails. Pigtails, right? yes, yeah. that is the next one. <laughs> Guess we're doing this one. This one is from A underscore V2M. Where do you see yourself in 10 years? Okay, what does that mean? In 10 years, when you are 50, <laughs> when you're 15 years old, Sienna, what are you gonna be doing in, in life? Like, where I work? Well, you're not gonna be working yet because you're only gonna be 15. You're still gonna be in high school, but you can still do whatever you want. You wanna know someone who's around that age? Mm -hmm. Charlie. Charlie is 16. Uh, it has been a long time since I've done these pigtails. <laughs> I'm trying to remember how to not leave all this hair down here. Like, I kind of want to do everything. You kind of want to do everything? Make YouTube videos, make TikToks, and I want to be making music. Ooh, yeah, that's a good pigtail right there. Music? Hold on, I'm not done yet. <laughs> Gotta spruce it up a bit with a with a scrunchie. That's what you do when it's not looking very fly. You guys, the pressure is on. Is it hot in here or is it just me? Here's Sienna, got some cheeses for you. I've always made it very apparent to not ever make it just about me. So I would like to answer this question. Where do I see us 
in 10 years because you're a big part of my life. Definitely, I would love to have like original music out, legit, like an album or two. I love what I do, I love being a cop, but I would love to be doing all of this full time. In 10 years, I hope to be still happy with <laughs> Zara. Uh, <laughs> in 10 years, who knows? Maybe there'll be another little kid running around, but that's a long time away. So check back in in 10 years. Honestly, I hope to have traveled the world in 10 years with you, Sienna, maybe visiting different countries and meeting our supporters out there who have, you know, DM'd us and been like, hey, can you come to Australia? Hey, can you come to India, the Philippines? Whatever it is, I would love to just travel the world and meet everyone. Pigtails? Done. Oh my, that you are so cute. Out of 10, what do you think? Be honest, I can take criticism. I no, can I would, take okay. constructive criticism. I would criticism. say 7.5. Yes. You heard it here, folks. 7.5 out of 10. You you would have gotten a higher score if, if you weren't pushing the... <laughs> the that's what the you little, gotta do. No. You gotta is, do that. That is not how you do it. You split your hair into two. And then oh, you push it up. I learned that one. I so learned you, that you one. You push it up instead of going. So like also, this. Also, you, you didn't part her hair. Oh, I didn't part her hair. So turn away, turn this way real quick. <laughs> so when it's loose, what you're gonna wanna do, folks, is you're gonna wanna grab two separate parts. Let me go like that. Boom. Money. This one is from Ileana Grant. How much time did you put in when you started TikTok? That's a great question. Honestly, it depends on the project, but I would say from the beginning, probably like 30 minutes a day maybe, just making funny videos. Now, when we got to the more extensive videos that kind of like, you know, told a story or were longer than like 10 seconds, then maybe we spent like an hour. But other than that, it's really just so easy to make a TikTok, just follow trends, have fun. The more complex videos you decide to learn and trends and stuff like that, the more time you'll be spending. We honestly probably spent more time watching TikToks than we did making them. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> we are gonna get ready for the next style of hair, and that's gonna be space buns! I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how to do space buns. <laughs> I don't know how to do them properly, so I'm gonna attempt one space bun, and Zara is gonna do the other space bun, and then we can compare space buns. My first instinct is to twist, so let's work with the twist. Let's see what happens when we twist. Okay, that's not working. The twist is not working. Let's try the finger twist. That's not working either. Let's try this now. This is a special tool that I uh, had handcrafted um, from the side of Mount Olympus out of a tree. Oh, we got it. This is not used for space buns. That was an informative part of the video. Okay, so we're gonna need an expert uh, to come in and show us how to do the space buns. You had the right idea. You twist, twist it. Okay, we're twisting. Except you keep twisting. You don't twist it into a bun. It'll make itself a bun. Watch. You keep twisting, and then you move up, and it'll start going wow. into a bun. <laughs> you okay, Sienna? Mm hmm Rubber band? Rubber band, please. We're gonna be twisting. Look, I'm twisting too. You're twisting too? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Once you get down there, you can't twist anymore. Yes, you right, can. You know what? I think I got it though. Yeah, it's the ant. Dang it. I lost the. <laughs> Give me another one. Hurry! Your big fingers are breaking them. My big fingers? I didn't ask for these, okay? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we have got what I think is the closest to a space bun I'm gonna get tonight. This is Zara's space bun, and here's my space bun. Can you look to the left, my love? That's the right. <laughs> <laughs> Your other left. <laughs> Cute! <laughs> Does it look pretty? <laughs> thank you! You're so polite. Sienna, I would just like to say thank you for being so patient. Would you rather be a unicorn or a mermaid? This is from Haley Loves Jojo. If I was a mermaid, like sharks can come up whenever they want, so I guess I would be a unicorn. Okay, I respect that. Can I choose one? Sure! Okay, got it. This one is from 2020 underscore Noel. What is your favorite TV show? There's so many. It's a three-way tie. Mandalorian, Glee, and The Office. What about Star Wars? Well, Star Wars is a movie. That's why I said The Mandalorian. So you gotta pick your favorite TV show. Star Wars. I mean, not Star Wars, just like The Mandalorian. Because of Baby Yoda? Yeah. Okay. And, and like the last episode, oh my God, I love you love the last episode? Me too. I'm going to attempt to do a braid. There's 
three pieces to a braid. I think you grab one, you get it ready, and then you grab the other braid. Turn all the way to the other side. <laughs> oh, you have a little freckle on the back of your head. There's a freckle back here. It's all about techniques. Drop it. <laughs> oh, can I get a, can I get an assist? Put that over there. That's, see, this is exactly what I was trying to do. I was trying to get a one long ponytail braid. Yes. All in one, easy, peasy, lemon, squeezy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let me finish it off. Let me finish it off. You guys are going to be impressed with this one right here. <laughs> Sienna, I just braided your hair. Yeah, Zara did most of it. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for giving me credit. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that Zara did most of it? Beautiful. Look at that. I did the rubber band at the end. So, ha! Yeah. Look how fast I can grab it. Wow. First of the last three questions. No peeking, guys. No peeking, guys. When did Sienna first start singing? This one is from S. Maddie 04. <sighs> Maybe three years old, two years old? I was old? just about to say that. Yeah? Let's, should we show everybody the video? Roll it! Man, this is incredible. I'll turn you in a bride of mine. All right, this one is from Micah from Brown University. Any advice for someone going through a mental battle? My advice to you is to surround yourself. You're so silly. Surround yourself by people who love and support you. And if you don't have that in your life, you can always message me on Instagram and I'll be there to talk to you. Last question, okay? What's the most fulfilling thing you've learned to love this past year? This is from Bella. Remember we made cookies in the sand with her on the beach? And then we let the waves eat them. Yeah? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you love to do? I love to go to Disneyland. Love to go ice skating. I love to go to Chuck E. Cheese. I like it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I you like spending time with your family? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I like going to Jonathan and Michael's. Yeah. And I love you. So sweet. My most fulfilling thing that I've learned to love this past year is, drum roll please, myself. I've learned to love myself for who I am. I've learned to be grateful for everything that I have in my life, which is something that we overlook like every day. I'm thankful for all of you guys. I'm thankful for you. Yeah. Love you. I'm thankful for you. And that's it. That's all I'm thankful for. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I've learned to be fulfilled and love a special person who walked into my life. Into our lives, actually. And like, she is coming right now. Come on. Come on, Come on. No, I have to. <laughs> Thanks for everything. Thanks for Thank always you. giving Sienna's hair. Of course. We appreciate uh, you. Speaking of hair, we have one more hairstyle to do. The ever elusive French braid. I actually know how to do a French braid, but it's a secret TikTok dad recipe that I can't share with anybody yet. So you guys are not gonna be able to see this next part while we get everything ready, okay? Here we go. All right, come here, let me see your hair. All right, ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, I present to you something legendary. Now, 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 I know you guys are all freaking out, but I'm sorry, I cannot reveal to you the secret to the French braid. Wow, that is beautiful. If you want tips and tricks on how to do a French braid, we are gonna have some videos linked in this video description on how to do a proper French braid. Thank you guys for hanging out with us. We love every single one of you. It's been a journey since the beginning. We're thankful to be going along with you guys. <laughs> See you in a... Peace out, Girl Scout. Love you guys. Always. Bye. <laughs>